okay guys for the sake of those of you that are asking how the process is for the turn station and the gas fee that is required let me just show you right away so in case you haven't done your daily spin okay in case you haven't done your daily spin which is a spin you can actually get three spins by uh, logging in every day and check okay you can see that i actually did this uh combo guess this past qualification i understood it you need to have at least fifty thousand um soon points to qualify for the pass qualification okay if you have below that then you are not eligible for the air job automatically this is what i'm talking about this spin lucky wheel three times i believe if you log in every day huh every day i think they will give you a, a, a free box daily i'm sure but i know i did not pay for this one remember in the previous video i was complaining that i was unable i would need to buy spin but i didn't i just tried verifying and i was able to verify without paying anything okay so it's actually free if you have been mining on a daily basis then you can get this free okay so for the buy me coffee it requires around 0 0.055 ton Okay, that's almost two dollars. Okay, so if I should go to my Tone Keeper application, you can see I've credited my account with them um, two point twelve dollars. Okay, that's around zero point six nine ton. Okay, and the required uh amount here for the coffee is zero point five five ton. Okay, so you must make sure that all seven of these tax is completed. If not, you will not be eligible. So make sure that this buy me a coffee is the one you do last. So in case you are not able to do the rest of them, then you know there's no need to buy them coffee. Because if you just buy them coffee and you are not eligible, you are not able to complete the rest, then you are wasting your money, you understand? So before if you are if you are having difficulties in buying coffee, you can click on this wallet, disconnect the wallet you have and reconnect it again. You understand so that it will verify with the application you are using i will recommend you use tongue keeper okay use tongue keeper okay you can see tongue keeper that's what i'm using okay so once you use tongue keeper verify it it will now connect it will now be showing you something like this here in your if you enter um settings if you enter settings up here if you come up here connected apps once you see you see in the tongue station will be showing here so make sure it's showing here like this if it's not showing here then you need to connect it it's connect the one that was in there connect it again uh -huh. so tongue keeper is easy for you to use so let me just open that application down real quick so so that it will be very fast for me to do this and um, buy coffee transaction okay so i just need to click on the buy coffee right now to redirect me to the tongue keeper application Okay, so let's give it a bit of time all right here yeah, and it's going to show me a verification where i'll approve the transaction that is being charged right now that's 0 0.55 ton you can see it here 0 0.0.55 0 .5 ton you get there's under five alongside it you get then plus a net small network fee charge again extra <laughs> so that's why i put 2.12 dollars you understand all right so that it does not have any issues when verifying so he's sending the transaction i will just need to go back to my application for it to verify i just click on this down arrow key okay they allow it to verify don't leave it. don't leave this page 0 0.5 ton sent and see it it has sent already all right so just leave it like this let it verify don't leave the page no matter what you do just stay be patient with it it will eventually load once the um, transaction verifies on the blockchain then it will not show done okay if you leave this page it might show an error you might have issues that your transaction now you sent money and you did not receive it if no, it's not verified and all that. That's when complaint will come. So allow this thing verify on its own before you eventually leave. So for the sake of this video, 
I will just skip all this process and I will show you the end of it after waiting. So let me just wait, then I will continue the video after it has verified. Okay. So guys, I was actually waiting on the application. So uh, I think somebody messaged me that I should actually uh, ask me the total amount of ton that it will require. So I went to my YouTube to reply. After replying the person, I came back, the application has crashed. So I had to reload it. I was actually worried just now that it might show me something else. So as I we logged in again, it showed me to claim i saw claim i click, clicked on claim and then this is what is now showing me so you can see now it said congratulations checklist you are awesome whatever so i've actually completed this task and i've gotten one key okay so it's now seven over seven so i'm good to go when the distribution process is going to be come and required for us to submit wallet or if it's going to distribute being distributed to our wallet directly i'll be a, a, a eligible participant to receive these particular tokens to my wallet so basically this is all this is just it okay so everything is done one two three four five six seven completed so that's just how you do it okay guys that's just how you do it nothing much so just make sure you have the available ton around zero you must have up to 0 0.55 ton plus gas fee so everything should be roughly around 0 0.6 ton to be safe you saw my own account uh -huh. you can even see the balance here let's see what's left of the balance out of the 2.12 dollars let's see the balance so even the network is even disturbing okay you can see i have just less than five five m cents so around 0 0.19 ton left on my balance so you can see that's what it is so that's just it guys go and complete your own if you know you have and um, if you are able to do the if you are able to do the six okay if you're able to do the six below okay like do one two three four five six then this buy me a coffee should be the last one you do take note of that all right